Hey guys, just doing a tour of my tool cart. It's gonna be a part one of multiple series. So on the side here, I keep my uh, little grabbers. Got a caulking gun back there, some scissors and box cutter for opening boxes. Down here, keep my wheel chocks and uh, Empty bottle of oil to use for measuring. Got my grease gun. This is my rolling cart that I sit on. Just, just store it there. Got vice grips in here. Some more vice grips. These are those like the 10 millimeter, 12 millimeter, 14 gear wrench. I think this is dual last set. Got some Allen's, Torx, metric and standard. This is my jumbo wrenches. Uh, the really big ones are Pittsburgh. That's the Dura Last. Husky back there. Not a really big thing on brands, as long as it works. Most of these I just buy just because I'm working on something and I really need the wrench or whatever. And, I run out to the store, grab what I need. Um, I mean, I like to have certain brands, but I mean, I'm not really particular in it. The job needs it, I need to get that done. So whatever is available. Same thing here. Uh, most of these are ratcheting. Uh, this one here, wrench. And then I need to do another set. These are old Pittsburgh I still have. Husky. So same thing here, you'll see 19 millimeter, you know, Craftsman, reversing one. These line wrenches, for doing brake lines, that's what I got them for. Some Duratec ones, some Matco flex head standard ratcheting wrenches. These are stubbies. Uh, this one's a cobalt. I just needed the 19, so I bought that one. All right, so I just redid this section up here. Here's an overview of it. So the way everyone can see it. All right, got back here. I got a Pittsburgh breaker bar, 24 inch, and then a 24 inch gear wrench, um, flex head ratchet. Things a beast. And these are all metric again. Okay, so back here I got mostly these, this is my half inch. Um, so the deeps are cobalt. And then I got one Craftsman back here, 27. This one's a performance tool one, like the AutoZone or O'Reilly's or somewhere. Uh, Cenex on 25, and I think I believe everything else um, is the Matco Silver Eagles. Eagles. All the way down to a 10. Uh, on the 3 8 that goes all the way up to 19. And then Sonex on the 20 for both uh, shallow and deep. And then, of course, this is for this. And I bought these to work on a forward drive shaft, few joints. All right, so these are the gray pneumatic uh, mid-lengths. These are the Sunex uh, stubbies and 3 8 um, These are the Matco with the easy outs or whatever for damaged uh, bolts, nuts. And then these are the Matco uh, quarter inch metrics. I think these are Titan Stubby Allens, and all these Universal Impact joints, uh, not joints, but uh, sockets. These are all Kesselman or Mixed Power is the brand that I got on Amazon. I mean, for four sets, basically, half inch deep and shallows, three eighths deep and shallows, all under 200 bucks. I mean, some of them, if you get a used set, but like $40, I mean, you can't beat that. 
And then here I got Sun X half inch and stubbies. So yeah, that's my tool cart. I still gotta do my toolboxes. I'll do a video on those later, another series. Thanks guys.